what's going on guys welcome back to crypto game mining where we're basically talking about everything that has to do with crypto mining and just passive income right so today is a big day we have everrise switching over to version 2.0 safe earn switching over to version 2.0 big day for passive income this video we're going to talk about everrise and how to switch over to the version 2.0 tokens we are also going to talk about staking your tokens so you can earn more tokens all right so before we get, begin make sure you're hitting that thumbs up subscribe if you guys are new let me know if you have already upgraded or if this video helped you out to upgrade your tokens with that let's go ahead we're going to switch on over to the everrise websites so we can do this all right guys so what you want to do first off is you want to go to the everrise website the finance website there's a, there's two websites you have a ever the everrise website which is everrise.com and then you have the everrise.finance website which the dot finance website is the website that you go to for ever own uh, for all the different contracts and all that stuff. So right here, you get to see all the different uh, contracts that is incorporated into the EverOwn project. Um, so you go to everrise.finance. I'll leave a list down or a link down below that will take you directly to the upgrade section. Okay, so you go to finance website. You click on Ever Migrate. You see that down below right there, and you click on Upgrade. You connect your your wallet. There will be a a button that says connect your wallet so you connect your wallet connected to whatever wallet you're using um, i use metamask i've already i've already migrated my tokens and i have them staked so this is what we're going to do i'm going to go ahead and connect all right so i've connected right here now what is what's going to happen is you're going to see your balance right so i have my balance over there i have three thousand tokens left um you know to be able to to migrate over uh let's see if it lets me do it because here's the issue, right? So like I had I had over a billion tokens that I needed to uh, to switch over and it wasn't letting me do it. And here's why. So if you have like a billion, so I had, I think it was a billion um, 400 and something thousand or not a thousand, uh, four, a billion and I think it was like 4 million something. So we're just going to put like random numbers, right? So if you have like, say it's like this, it's not going to migrate it properly. So if I hit max, let's do this properly. Let's just put a whole bunch of numbers, right? So you can see right here, it's not going to do it properly, right? It's going to want to round. All right. So you see right here, I inputted, let's say, what is this? 1,425,341,583. Look at the output because it consolidates 10,000 to one. Look at the output. The output is 142,534. So it stops right here. 142,534. Stops right here. Now, the rest of this isn't going to switch over. You need, at that point, to just get rid of those and put it, replace them with zeros. Okay? One more zero. So I replace it with zeros. And now I would be able to migrate. So you go ahead and you click migrate. So best way to go, hit max, and then replace the last few uh, last few digits with zeros until you get the proper amount. So if you have, so you have a hundred thousand tokens, right? If you have hundred thousand tokens, it's going to give you ten because it's ten to one. But if you had let's say 100,052. It's not going to give you those 52. You got to get rid of those 52 and replace it with zeros. So you understand what I'm talking about? So if we had, let's say, we go to a billion, right? So you have a billion tokens. If you had a billion 100, it's going to go to 100,000. It's not going to give you that 100. You have to get rid of those and replace it with zeros. Once you do that, then you hit migrate. And when you migrate, the tokens will go ahead and swap over. So if I was to go with my max balance, I can't do it because I don't have 10,000 tokens to switch over to one token. So that that remaining balance, the 3,460, it's just going to forever be in that, uh, 
in my MetaMask wallet, and that's just what it's going to have to be, unfortunately. But not a big deal. I've already migrated my billion tokens over, and yeah, I'm good to go on that. Once you do that, okay, you need to input into your MetaMask wallet the new EverRise token address. Okay, the new EverRise token address is available on EverRise's Twitter account. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and down below in the description, leave a link to this token address. So this address right here, I will leave a link in the description for you guys. So you can copy this token address and paste it into your EverRise or into your EverRise, into your MetaMask. So you go ahead, token address and paste it in there. I've already added it. And that's the new EverRise MetaMask or MetaMask, the new token address for EverRise. Okay, so that is the token address. Doesn't matter if you're on BNB Network. Doesn't matter if you're on Ethereum. Doesn't matter if you're on Polygon Network. It's the same address for all three of them. All right. So, like you said, trading won't go live until November 29th, but you can transfer or upgrade to the version 2.0 and it gets sent to that address to your own wallet. Once you do that, if you want to stake your, your coins, Go over here to Everstake, click on List. Okay, so on List, you can go ahead and stake your token. So whatever you have available, you can type in whatever amount that you want to stake. So for me, I'm staking all my coins or all my tokens. If I buy more tokens, I'm going to stake those as well. I can't buy any right now because trading is locked. But this is, this is how you do it. So you type in whatever amount that you want to stake. You can type in whatever name you want and for whatever lock period that you want. If you want to stake it for a year, you can stake it for a year. If you want to stake it for a couple months, you can stake it for a couple months. If you want to stake it for one month, you stake it for one month. The only thing is I don't know what the percentage is on the staking. They haven't said yet, so I'm just going to leave it there staking. Staking is available early for you guys who have upgraded right now. Um, I'm actually going to ask, you know, I'm going to send them a message or whatever to ask them what uh, what the percentage is on staking. They, it's not on their blog, nothing like that. Um, I wish they would tell us because it'd be nice to know the percentage so we know how much we're getting back. But yeah, that's that's pretty much it. It's just simple, easy to do, not, not complicated at all. Um, once I got it taken care of, it went quick. It took me a little bit to figure out because of the whole, like, the whole upgrade process, like just having to replace these four digits with zeros. Um, that's really what did it for me because, uh, again, it's 10 to 1. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope I was able to help you guys out with this. Hit the thumbs up if I did or even if I didn't and you you just like my bald head. I don't care. Hit the thumbs up. Subscribe if you guys are new. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Everybody, I say happy mining. We're just going to stick with it. Happy mining.